What's going on guys? I am back with another Pokemon Gold and Silver 3DS Virtual Console tutorial. Today I'm going to be going over one of the most basic yet most important and most powerful glitches in the entire generation and that's how to clone Pokemon. This also gives you access to an unlimited amount of items of your choosing, whether it's rare candies or master balls or TMs, and it's super simple to do. And really all you need to do is have the Pokemon an item that you want to clone and access to a PC. So firstly, we're going to have our Pokemon that we want to clone which is the, the Lake of Rage Gyarados. And we'll be using this in, an, in a tutorial that shows you how to get increased shiny Pokemon odds. So make sure you subscribe and stay tuned for that one. So we're gonna need another Gyarados because it involves trading. So what we're going to do is give uh, the item we wanna clone to the Gyarados, which happens to be a Master Ball. And then we're going to save our game right in front of the PC. And this is really easy and it's almost impossible to do incorrectly so you don't have to worry about you know running your save file or anything just do as i do and everything will work out so we'll open our pc and we can just go ahead and get into the the boxes so what we're going to do is we're going to choose a box that's em a box that's empty and i'm already on box four and it's empty it doesn't have to be empty i just like to do it that way uh, because it helps with cloning more pokemon uh, and doing it faster so we're going to deposit our Gyarados into the box that we want and we're going to go ahead and go to change box and it doesn't matter what box you change to you can change to any box other than the one that you're currently in so we'll go ahead and change the box one and i'll ask you if you want to save and you say okay and then once you get to the is it okay to overwrite page you're just going to hit yes and then you're going to tap the bottom screen and as long as you tap the bottom screen before this message stops so anytime before saving don't turn off the power before that message is done it'll work it'll be fine so you have a ton of room really hard to mess up usually I do it a little faster like maybe like when like the saving first pops up but uh, you really don't have to get any kind of advanced timing down then you're just gonna click restart on the bottom of the screen it'll restart your game and it'll bring you back to the point when you saved before the PC so make sure you definitely save before the PC is that is the most important part uh, as you can see we still have our Gyarados with our master ball right in our party here and then we'll go into our PC and we'll go to withdraw and there you go we have another Gyarados and another master ball so the cool thing about this is that you can do up to five Pokemon at once so suppose you want to just keep doing this and keep mass cloning items I can now save the game once more after withdrawing the Gyarados as you need to have that that state where both Gyarados are in your party and we'll go back into the PC after we save we will deposit both Gyarados this time and like before change box and here we did it a little bit earlier just to show you that you can do it pretty much at any time you want just do it relatively quickly so if you don't want to wait too long because if you wait too long then you'll just save the game and it won't work so uh, we'll just do that we'll open up our roster we have two Gyarados both have master balls like before and we'll go back to our PC and there we go we have four Gyarados and four master balls and obviously you can do up to five Pokemon at once because you have to keep the six Pokemon in your party because you have to have at least one and you can just keep cloning and fill up your boxes and then take the items off and then release the Pokemon and keep going and keep going. So that way you can fill up on rare candies, fill up on Master Balls or whatever items you want. If you want nuggets for money or TMs to transfer up to Sun and Moon when that's available, it's all up to you. So that's going to be it for us today. Uh, super simple, super easy tutorial, but it's very important and very powerful as leveling up in this game has always been kind of a challenge because everything's such a low level. And that really helps if you want to use things like Tyranitar uh, and Dragonite that you get kind of late in the game uh, and level them up before you fight red. Or if you just want to battle uh, via local wireless uh, with your friends, that helps a lot too. So that's going to be it for me today, guys. Make sure you subscribe and leave a like on the video if it helped you. And stay tuned, I do have tutorials coming up on how to get Celebi uh, and also how to get Pokemon with increased shiny odds. So stay tuned for that and I will see you guys next time. Peace.